Let's write a C program to print all the prime numbers between 2 to n, n being user entered number. We will be using nested for loop in this program, okay? Well, prime number is a natural number greater than 1 which has no positive divisors other than 1 and itself. So assume that we have 2 to n numbers, n being the user entered number, we will write outer for loop for that. So we initialize num to 2 and iterate this for loop until num is less than or equal to n. That means the outer for loop fetches number 2 to n one by one for each iteration of that outer for loop. So once the number is selected for every iteration, the inner for loop divides it, divides that selected number from 2 to num minus 1 times. If any of those numbers from 2 to num minus 1 divide that selected number perfectly, then it's not a prime number or else it's a prime number. For example, if the number is 41, the inner for loop divides this 41 from 2 to 40 times. Count is less than 41 means 40 is count is equal to until count is equal to 40 so 41 is divided by all the numbers between 2 to 40 if any of those number perfectly divide the number 41 then 41 is not a prime number if none of the numbers from 2 to 40 perfectly divide the number 41 then 41 is a prime number so let's check that in our program i'll take couple of integer variables num count limit and prime i'll ask the ask the user to enter the limit uh, nothing but n and i'll store that inside the address of variable limit so i'll print out a message that prime numbers from 2 to percentage d are so percentage d the value is present inside the address of variable limit so now i'll write the outer for loop to select numbers from 2 to limit so i'll initialize num to 2 this for loop executes until num is less than or equal to limit that is user entered number and num plus plus for each iteration of this outer for loop num increments by one let me print out the values of num okay so this for loop prints values from 2 to user entered limit I'll enter limit 50 so it should print all the numbers between 2 to 50 not the integer prime numbers all the integer numbers 2 to 50 okay let me remove this so observe carefully this for loop selects number from 2 to limit it selects the number one by one okay so I'll assume that the selected number which is present in variable num is a prime number it's just the assumption this inner for loop checks if that selected number is prime or not. So I'll start the count from 2 till the count is less than num. Okay, less than num. Remember, sh shouldn't write less than or equal to because every number will be divisible by itself. So exclude that by writing count is less than num. So count is initialized to 2 because uh, every number is perfectly divisible by 1. So leave that 1 and start with 2. So now we will check if the selected number modulo division count is equal to zero. That means it's perfectly divisible by any number. Then it's not a prime number. So I'll assign zero to prime and break out of that inner for loop. So after that, I'll write if prime. That means if prime is equal to one, if prime is still non-zero integer number, then it's a prime number. So I'll print that. Uh, number which is present inside the variable num onto the console window so i'll write 25 the limit as 25 so these are the prime numbers between 2 to 25 okay so let me execute once again this time i'll give 50 so these are the prime numbers between 2 to 50 you can verify that individually okay Let's optimize this code and reduce the number of iterations of this inner for loop. So I'll take another variable inum. Let me come down here after the prime is equal to 1. So inum is equal to selected number divided by 2. So inner for loop executes only half the times the selected number. So count is equal to uh, less than or equal to inum will do the job. So let me compile and run this program. I'll give 25 once again. So it's giving the same results. Okay. Let me further optimize and reduce the number of iterations of this inner for loop. I'll include math.h library file 
and make use of built-in function that is sqrt square root of the selected number so inner for loop executes only a square root of the selected numbers time so i'll give 25 once again and we get the same result let me execute once again and give 40 now so you can individually verify this i'll give 40 you can individually verify these prime number if these numbers are prime numbers or not so these are the prime numbers between 2 to 40 so this is the code to fetch all the prime numbers between 2 to user entered number so please visit the link present in the description section of this youtube video for source code notes and discussion about this topic please stay subscribed to our youtube channel and blog share this video with your friends online and please do not forget to like this video on youtube thank you